All right, everybody, welcome back. Mark here with Miramar College, and we're going to be talking about CPR AED today. Let's run through the skill verbally, talk about some other things later on. So we're going to start off every skill, standard precautions, scene safety, and we're going to attempt to question any bystanders about the arrest events. Did you see what happened as we're walking up? And then we're going to check responsiveness. We're going to use our AFPU acronym, tap and shout, sir, ma'am, wake up, open your eyes, no response, painful stimuli. If the patient is unresponsive to painful stimuli as they are in this scenario, we're going to turn to our partner and request an AD and ALS. Then we will assess for a pulse and breathing at least five, no longer than 10 seconds. Remember that's a carotid pulse. Make sure your fingers are in the appropriate location when you're checking that. Then you'll find that the patient is apneic and pulseless. You immediately begin chest compressions at the appropriate depth and rate, allowing the chest to recoil completely. That's very important. And then you perform two minutes of high quality, single rescue or adult CPR at the adequate depth and rate, proper compression to ventilation ratio. For national registry standards, that's going to be 30 to two. Allows the chest to recoil completely adequate volumes for each breath. So make sure you get chest rise and then minimal interruptions, less than 10 seconds throughout. After two minutes, the patient is assessed and a second rescuer resumes compressions while the candidate operates the AED. So you'll turn it on, follow the prompt, correctly attach it, stop CPR. Everybody's clear during analysis, ensures that individuals are clear of the patient and delivers a shock from the AED, immediately directs the rescuer to resume chest compressions. So that's the end of the skill. We just verbally ran through it. Let's talk a little bit about chain of survival. I think it's important to talk about these things. Early recognition, early access, that's number one. Early high quality CPR, number two. Rapid defibrillation, number three. Number four is ALS intervention and continuing post-cardiac arrest care is number five. Summary of high quality CPR, hand placement, heel to hand, center of the chest, lower half of the breastbone. As you can see in this picture, the rate is 100 to 120 beats per minute and the depth for adults should be at least two inches, no more than 2.4 inches. Again, I should have put the ratio on here, but it's just National Registry AHA standards. It should be review for everybody. That's going to be 30 compressions to two ventilations. Make sure you get chest rise. Make sure you have a good face to mask seal with your pocket mask. These are the training AEDs we use. So basically, I mean, they're very easy. Basically, all you have to do is open up the AED, pull the red handle, place the yellow pad on the right breast. So as you can see in the pictures right here, we'll zoom in a little bit. Yellow pad on the right breast place the red pad onto the left mid axillary chest as you can see here just follow it exactly as you see in the picture and then once the pads are applied the machine will instruct you to clear the patient it'll analyze the rhythm you actually don't have to press a button to analyze the rhythm that's pretty nice and then it'll basically give you a shock advised no shock advised we have a program to give you a shock advised it'll charge up It'll have a flashing red button. You'll make sure everybody's clear again, and then you will press the shock button. And that's really it. Again, this should be review. Everybody should have had their AHA, Lifeguard, or American Red Cross uh, CPR certification before coming into class. So this should really be something that you guys have seen already and have practiced a few times. But if you have any questions, I'm more than happy to answer any of them. If you guys leave a comment or send me a message on Canvas, I'll see you guys on the next one. Uh, have a good one.